Oh no, it actually has a whole bunch of shit in it. What the? F Where did they go? In a car? Hello everyone, welcome back to House Flip. We're getting ready to almost uh, flip this island house that we've been working on. I think we're going to do a little bit of the downstairs. And I would like to freestyle a bathroom out of nowhere to see if that's even possible. Two bathrooms if we can get in there. So let's go ahead and jump into this and see what we can get into. I just re <laughs> I just realized the redundancy of having a Christmas tree on an island that no one's going to see. So, I mean, hey, might as well still do it, right? Uh, so we're going to take a look at the downstairs. Uh, and I would like to freestyle a bathroom in here. Since we, oh wow, I forgot I did this little room here. Um, and then we're going to also have just all this room. So what we could do, oh God, you know how weird that would be to have the bathroom door open or just a door open up into the bathroom. But then again, if you're just here and you just want to, honestly, we're going to do it. So let's go ahead and get our wall here. We're going to make another wall. And uh, I love how it tells me there's not enough room to place the wall, even though it has zero issue placing the wall. Uh, to any degree. Not at all. All right. So let's keep this up here. You're going to see what I'm going to try to do. Uh, so we're going to have to put another door in here. And this is going to be the bathroom that we are making. The wall to the bathroom next to the room. Uh, and I would do it the other way. But I feel like to have the big part of the, you know, room left would be perfect for the bedroom, not a bathroom. So as we can see here, this is like the perfect size bedroom. It might even be too long, but it'll work. Um, so for the door, we didn't even have to do that. So shit, you know what would have been good is if I would have looked to see where the fucking thing is, but I will just go as center as I can make it here. There we go. Doors are pretty large here in this game. Fuck, I think that might've been bad. Clear all that shit out if we can. Hey, come on. Let me go. Uh... I guess that could work. It's not exactly where I wanted it, but shit, it'll do. Uh, so let's open up our doors. We're going to do, I guess we do recently viewed items. It's not there, huh? Son of a bitch. I wish you could copy and paste stuff, but unfortunately, that's just really not how it works in this game. So you have to go and it said, see, this is a problem. Like if you do any renovations to the home afterwards, finding the same goddamn door that you most likely used is pretty not that hard, I guess, if we take a look at it. I just found it and had to get rid of it because of this stupid shit. There we go. All right, we're going to buy this. Let's see if this works. I flip it around. Yeah, that's looking solid. Okay, and then we'll go in with the uh, half wall. I don't know. For some reason, one side's going to have like the lip and the other side doesn't, but I guess that doesn't matter. All right, half wall. Let's get this wall completed here. Uh, and this will be, like I said, the weirdest fucking... So someone who lives downstairs, it'll have to be like their own apartment. Because once they go through the first door, it's their bathroom. So it's going to be a little weird, but it'll work. Uh, so let's get some lights. It is dreadfully... Let's just do lights. Nope, I guess we're going to have to do lamp. Okay, ceiling. We'll just do black ceiling lamps. I think that'll look nice and uh, solid in here. There's a very long room, so I think three would be sufficient. We'll move those around here accordingly. Let's get one in here. I think we're going to need one in here, too. I feel like right in the middle. Perfect. So we're going to need to get light switches because there's no light switches anywhere, except for unless this kind of handles all of downstairs. No, it doesn't. So we're going to need a light switch real quick because that ain't working. So light Ooh. switch. Uh-oh. Maybe I should just call it a switch. A switch? Oh, the elegant double light switch. Let's look at all these. Is a plug here? These motherfuckers. I'm going to do the double, I think. Nah, I'll just do modern. Oh, that's weird, huh? Okay, let's get some uh, switches added in here. That way when people exit and leave these rooms, they can flick on the lights. Damn, looks 20 million times better in here. And test that one out as well, too. So this is the bathroom. This is what I was talking about. This will be just kind of like the entry room down, which I guess 
their entry room into their house will be their restroom and then this will be the bedroom uh it doesn't it technically never even had this in the first place so we might as well do what we can so let's uh start with the bed here uh get something i don't know if anything's gonna fit because this will be such a narrow goddamn area that we're gonna be working with would something like this even fit down here that would be hilarious if it did oh <laughs> uh, they're gonna have no walking room at all Honestly, I say we fucking do it. Can they, can it work? Oh shit, it worked. Hell yeah, dude. Will a nightstand fit? That's going to be the question. The ultimate question. But that shit looks kind of fire though. I just, I hope we can fill it out. They, they're going to have to do more of their own decorations inside this bitch. But at least we can get it semi-furnished in this bitch. Uh, okay, so for furniture, let's do living room. Uh, we could do shelves, sofas, tables. I would like to do some type of entertainment table thing. Uh, something that we put a TV on. Unless we want to go fancy and put it on a wall. But I feel like, well, either way, it's going to be super far back. Then again, we could fill it in with some chairs. Yeah, let's fill it in with some chairs. These are not going to look good at all in any way, shape, or form. We're going to try to make it work. I guess we can make an entertainment area out of this. So we'll move this back just a little. Those are not lined up for shit. Let me just do it from this side here. There we go. That's a little better. This room is getting tiny and tinier as it's fucking going on. But, oh, I can even sit down and use it. That's perfect. Okay, that is like the perfect distance. So, from the bed, it's a little too far. But, I'm honestly, we're going to have to make do with what we can. I can't sit in the bed. But, honestly, it'll still work. So, let's do the flat screen. Let's do a TV. Uh, I guess we'll do a hang. Let's do a soup. Oh, that's not going to fucking work in any way, shape, or form. Uh, that's not going to work. So medium it is. Well, that's sad. That's still massive, though. Holy shit. All right. Firm. Perfect. Let's go ahead and sit back down and just visualize it. That is just phenomenal. All right. So that's working well. Uh, I'm thinking some big piece of artwork here. So we'll go back to decorations. And we'll kind of just take a look by scrolling through this shit. And see what we can put on here that would kind of vibe with what's going on. Uh, there's a photo view of Vancouver. All right, good. Fuck it, honestly, right? Let's go. Let's see how big the large is here. That's that's a little big. I think medium is the sweet spot for some areas like this. So let's go ahead and put this like right there. We'll get something on the other side of the wall as well, too. I want to try to stick to some theme. I swear to God, I end up using like the same photos over and over and over again. Just because they're easy to kind of go back to. Um, a photo of New York. That's kind of cool. All right. Let's put this up like right here. It's definitely going to make the room feel a lot more claustrophobic. But at the end of the day, I think it'll still be cool. So where the bed is, let's, let's kind of do uh, black and white photos just to kind of separate the room. Oh, I do like the Aurora, Aurora Borealis. So let's see if we could add this massive son of a bitch thing. I'm just going to put it in the bathroom because why not feel like you're taking a shit in outer space? And I need one more black and white photo. It seems like we've kind of passed up all the black and white photos here. So let's pick something that's just in the mix of stuff that's already there. I think some type of mirror would be cool. I saw a mirror. Mirror module. That actually would be good in the bathroom, I think. Holy fuck. How big is that? What the shit? Oh my god, they're just getting bigger. Okay, that works. I don't know why they were so massive. I don't know what that would do at the end of the day. All right, let's find that one black and white photo if we can. Uh, just need Uno Mas. We got photo of New York on one side. I have this one, but I feel like this is going to be the wrong orientation from what I want. But then if we want to be able to see it, I guess that could work too. No, that could work. That's kind of cool. It's like the majority of that one is black to white. Majority of this one is white to black. So I could fuck with it. Uh, that wall is looking a little basic. All right. So we need some type of just kind of like an entertainment system. So, okay. I'm going to use something like this. We did this last time uh, somewhere. I'm not sure if it was this house or another one. Uh, but we're going to use two of these to kind of get this the way we want it to look. So let's scoot this over here. And that way we get two of these in here. And this is going to create more of like a longer looking shelf underneath the TV. Won't really have anything to do with the TV. But oh God, you can't have them close together. 
That's okay. It still looks good, though, because you have two of them. All right, so that's perfect. You got a little bit of that, a little bit of that. Fucking bed over there with all the red. I think the red kind of throws it off a little, uh, but that's fine. Okay, so this is left with our bathroom here, so I'm going to shut these doors so we can see. So I think the biggest thing that we want to make sure we don't do is use these two walls where the doors are at. So pretty much we're going to have to put all the stuff that we need in this bathroom around these walls. So I might have to move this photo, but at least for now we'll kind of get it started. So we're going to do... Um, I guess we could do a shower plumbing. And this kind of shows us where we can put this without it fucking shit up here. So remember the door opens inwards. So putting it near that wall might not be the best thing here. If I turn it, oh shit. If I turn, I don't think I can turn it to be honest. Here we go. So this photo is uh, being a problem here. So let's get rid of it really quick. Okay, that should allow us to put our shower down, at least in this corner, yeah. Perfect. All right, let's get this uh, somewhat ready for the actual shower that we're going to buy. We haven't bought one yet, but at least we get the plumbing. Uh, shower's going to go in the corner. I think a sink would be good here. And I think the toilet over here, probably. So let's get rid of this. So let's do uh, toilet. Typing with my left hand, it makes... God damn it. Back that up a little. Toilet plumbing system. Okay. And the toilet will go over here. Kind of near the mirror. In between the uh, shower that we haven't put down. And that is that. Okay. Good to go. We'll buy the toilet. And then last but not least, we're going to do a sink. And the sink will kind of go right next to the shower. In between where the door opens up. So if someone does open the door up from the other side. At least it's not going to block the sink to a tremendous degree here so let's get these all off we're gonna get our uh stuff down here i don't even think we have no we do have a really nice bathroom upstairs here so that's cool so let's try to make another nice one uh sink toilet plumbing and we can do bathroom fixtures it's gonna have all of our stuff that we need uh genie shower without a tray what the fuck that's kind of cool i like that i think that would not work though with the what we did Will it? Is it just like literally use the bathroom, the bathroom floor and just doesn't even give a fuck? How's that going to work though? I guess. Oh, you're just going to get the, well that, no, that could, that could be nice actually. I don't know how I feel about that. Why even have a door in the first place? What the fuck? I don't know. We might have to sell that and swap it out with something like this. Something that has... That's what we're going to do. We're going to get the Ellie corner one. So let's, uh, that's a waste of money. Bathroom fixtures. Let's, uh, Ellie corner shower. We're going to do a nice all black aesthetic here in the bathroom. So it still has like the same look as the last one. Just the difference is that it has a complete shower. So you're not soaking absolutely everything and it has walls uh that go all the way around which is kind of nice there we go that looks so much better okay because it actually looks like a normal fucking shower that's not going to soak everything in the bathroom uh as for a toilet let's see pretty much got slim pickings with this but we'll have to go white toilet here shit that's not that's not even against the wall my guy hold on get rid of you yeah i don't know why i did that uh, let's make sure it's against the wall. Also, let's make sure it's uh, equal here between this. So that way we don't have an issue. Okay, we're going to put it down right there. It's looking solid. Set it down, put the top, put the lid, and done. And that leaves us kind of like an off room for like a toilet paper holder and stuff like that. Uh, but we'll get all that here shortly. Let's get ourselves a nice sink. This one doesn't look too bad. Do that nice black base. And I, I don't I don't mind that marble countertop, honestly. That's not bad. Perfect. And it keeps it off to the right a little from the door. Can't be any better than that. Alright. What are we doing here? Don't start any water because we've done this before, but we fucked everything up and it started leaking water everywhere. Very relaxing game with the music, though. Oh shit. Okay. 
Good to go. Can I test it out? I cannot test it out, which is kind of lame. I can't even open the bottom fucking drawers. Let's test the drawer or the uh, door opening. Nice. You could still use the sink too. Perfect. Well, shit, that actually worked relatively well. Uh, that doesn't hit the countertop. You could still use the sink even with the door open. That's yeah, not bad at all. Holy shit, I like that. All right, then we just have to get it all painted so it's all one color here, uh, pretty much everywhere. Because we did have some construction, so we're working on like different color paints and stuff. I'm gonna paint all of down here uh, a crystal color. I, I have a feeling that's gonna come out like the blue that we pretty much have done elsewhere. See, it says it's painting it, but I don't see anything happen. Well, maybe I do see something happening. I, I should just go with like a nice white because crystal's coming out to be... What the fuck is it even... What the fuck? You can paint the roof? Since when can you paint the fucking roof? In this... Oh, God. And it's doing it through the wall. I don't like that at all. Why is it doing that? That's so not good at all. Oh, no. Oh, shit, man. I don't know if the painting the whole wall is a good thing in this game. Or, like, the ceiling. I just don't know. Because, like, we're going to... we're to, Look at how many accident... Leap. Oh no, it's even doing the motherfucking walls in here. No, because we put walls up in here. What the fuck is going on? That is the weirdest shit. It definitely updated when we played it, but I didn't think it was going to fuck it up like that. That's just insane. So let's paint this up. We've got a few walls in here uh, to paint up to this like crystal color, which is not white. Whatever they had on there, I guess, is like plaster. It looks more white than the fucking crystal that we picked, which is unfortunate. Uh, we have some fucking horrible painted walls, uh, ceilings and shit like that because of whatever fucking mod update came out. I don't know. That's toxic. Completely fuck shit up. Patches of fucking paint everywhere. Okay, everything's complete. The only thing that's not done is the roof of this bathroom, which honestly I feel like might just be worth keeping it white since it didn't somehow clip through the wall when I tried to paint everything else. Let's go upstairs and make sure we don't have any crucial damage uh, elsewhere because it started fucking up there. Everything looks good. God, this bathroom looks nice. Okay. Yeah, wow. Kitchen looks fucking solid here. We even got goddamn uh, decorations and shit up. Fucking A, man. No, this looks way better than it uh, was before. Honestly, this is kind of like as much work as we should be putting into these homes. That way we keep them around for a couple episodes and we're already off to another one. Uh, and I'm curious how much this work would give us you know what i mean so let's uh i say we flip this shit we could do maybe a few more things but i don't think there's anything else left to do there's literally i just i want to collect this last one i don't know where the fuck it's at though or what we would have to do to collect it uh let's start selling some stuff i pretty much done everything on the outside the outside of the house looks solid uh plaster paint let's get rid of some of this shit i can almost smell the paint on the walls like that's how fucking clean this house is all right nothing else left over uh, we just need like a mirror, I think, because I realize that has nothing. So let's do a mirror. Uh, I guess like a square mirror. What the fuck size is that, dude? That's not going to work. Let's go back to the drawing board. Uh, Alita mirror. Okay. That's not bad. There we go. Oh, I can turn on the light. Well, how be damn? That's fancy. All right. I say we flip this shit. Let's just go ahead and flip it. There's honestly not anything else we could do. We could just keep, you know, messing around with it. But at this point, let's sell that shit. So quick breakdown of this house. You bought this house for $90,453. House parcel area is 185. I don't know what that means. The house has 90.69 something something and five rooms. Damn, we counted that shit up to the five rooms. I think it only had uh, like two before. So that's not bad at all. Okay, uh, we're going to put it on the auction. Let's go ahead and see what we got. 158. Oh, I think we're going to make some decent money on this bitch. Holy shit. Then we don't even have to put much work into this, dude. What the fuck? Oh, yeah. Lately, there are loads of Norwegians here. They look for houses and pay heavily for renting one, but only if there is an in-home sauna. Expensive items in a house... For rent is a bad idea. What if tenants damage them? Well, that's on you, bro. I'm, I'm selling this shit. I'm flipping that shit. Uh, we're accepting that offer. Let's go. 78,000, which means let's uh, see how much we actually have in our... That's a drastic fucking change there. Bathroom looks solid, too. The bedroom looked like a crack den, so that's completely different. Oh, yeah. Solid. 
my Christmas lights. Those were a trash idea. Shit. All right. There you go. We have another house flipped in our portfolio there. Uh, that one was actually, I think, a good amount. So the next thing that we're going to be doing, I think, instead of anything, let's make ourselves an office here or buy a place. Damn, 202 702. Hell yeah. Let's go ahead and take a look at this laptop really quick. I'm curious to see what we got. Uh, we got a browser here. So we need a new office. Uh, but we also need to make sure we got a house. So I think spending about, I don't know, our options for offices are probably quite small. Almost only a garden. So there's no house here. Uh, it's just only a garden pretty much. I don't like that. 62. I think no. Well, we don't want to use too much because we have 200,000. Ah, fuck. Maybe not an office first. Maybe we should try to do one more. A two-story would be nice. 142, leaving about 60,000 for renovations. This one isn't bad. 150, leaving about 50,000 for renovations. I can't remember how much we spent, but I know it wasn't a lot. So basically, it's in between. I want to do like 100,000 to 150-ish. So uh, this one would have to be fully repainted. I'm going to be honest. I'm leaning towards the pink kingdom here. So we're going to scratch getting a new office. This has two floors and six rooms. That's a lot of rooms. Uh, everything looks really clean. Wait, hold on. We're buying this. You bought a new house. You want to go there right now? Yeah, we're going to go. If that's the case, we're going to make so much money on furniture alone. And what the fuck? Like, oh no, it actually has a whole bunch of shit in it. What the fuck? Where did they go? In a car? For 18000 right up off the top, fucking making that money. Okay, this garage is going to be spicy. Yeah, fuck all this shit. We're going to make that quick money really quick. And if it's not going to sell for money, then we'll just go ahead and fucking get rid of it. All right, already left to the clean garage. We had like 60000 We already made 18000 back just like that. That's fucking absurd, dude. Let's check uh, this whole house out. This is interesting. Like, <laughs> this just goes to show... The level of detail one person puts into this versus someone else who just fucking slaps it together and just sells that shit. I uh, almost sold the bed there. Let's get rid of all this stuff, though. We're obviously not going to want to keep this aesthetic of whatever the fuck this crazy cat lady had going on here. But, I mean, it just goes to show the level of sophistication that you could do in this game, though. That's for sure. Uh, let's just get rid of all this stuff. Perfect. Get rid of that. Oh, I just got rid of the window, but that's okay. We can get that back. Let's try to make sure we don't delete any more windows. Well, fucking A, bro. We're already back up to that much fucking money. <laughs> that's quality. I don't know why it came stocked. Like, what was the point of that? A lot of this uh, equipment and stuff, we could keep. Fridge is fucking awful with the pink flower on it. So we're going to get rid of that. Uh, but we can keep kind of like most, if not all of this stuff. I'm going to get all this shit gone because I don't like that. That shit looks old. That is awful. Get rid of that, too. We're going to swap it around. We're going to probably put the couch on the backside, TV over there. Uh, so let's get rid of all that as well. We'll uh, move this. Uh, some of the stuff we don't have to get rid of. So, But this, 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 this. Anything pink, yeah, got to go. Uh, that's actually a really good idea. So this right now is being used as a laundry room and a bathroom. So that's what we're going to do on this one is keep the laundry room, bathroom aesthetic going on. Uh, we're already up to 83,000 and we were at 60. So that's not bad at all. And we have pretty much everything that we want gone. Uh, as for the most of this, I'm going to keep it so I can kind of understand the layout that worked best for this home. I, I got to admit, it did look good. The stuff that they used was trash, but uh, for the most part, it was actually decent. I don't know what the fuck that is, but we're just going to get rid of it. Get rid of that that just get rid of the bed oh my god we're gonna have to do some major fucking painting in this bitch holy shit that looks hazardous what the fuck is there really no railing they could have added there well most of the stuff is gone then um all right so they don't have a pink washer it just looks pink because it's fucking reflecting so yeah that's pretty much it even the outside is pink i know the neighbors hated this shit beyond belief it's gonna need some pretty big uh weed reduction and stuff where we kind of come in and uh trim up the grass and all that but this yard will look really good when we kind of get done with that 
Just trying to get preliminary bullshit right now. All these tall ones. We'll do that right now. Okay, everything in the yard's been picked up weed-wise. I think it looks much better. I didn't do, like, the small, tiny ones. But at least the uh, large weeds and all that are gone now. And uh, we'll get in there and trim it all up. But I'd say this is going to be a fun little start. And uh, we even have more money to get an office if we really wanted to. But I think this is going to be like a perfect start to kind of get back into everything. I'm not going to worry too much about... Well, we should do paint first. Because this is a whole bunch of pink purples and just a whole bunch of god-awfulness. I want to find a good, like, nice white. So I guess we could look at that really quick. Okay, they are working. I wasn't sure if they were working or not. Okay, I think that one looks really good. This is just labeled white. I guess it doesn't have any other, you know, connotations to it where it's going to change it up. Like almond or whatever the fuck that they were going by. Uh, let's turn on some of the lights in here and see what lighting we have going on. Plenty of lights to kind of work with as well, too. Okay, we'll be able to find a TV remote and all that stuff again. Well, first things first, I'm going to start with painting the uh, garage. Just to kind of get one room uh, <laughs> ready and assembled and good to go. Uh, away from the pink. It's going to be so many rooms that we have to do. I don't think we've taken such a big job as this before. Uh, but I think this is going to net us a ton of money. And I want to try to do something a little bit different with this house. Maybe like building a sauna or something like that. Because I always have seen people go, Oh, I really want a sauna inside the home. Okay, fucking rich asshole. We'll do that. Um, so I don't know how to do that necessarily. But I think that would be a fun uh, thing to just kind of pick with one of the rooms to do. So one of the rooms definitely upstairs are going to have that. Uh, the garage obviously is going to be a garage. I don't mind the floor. It looks a little weathered, though, and uh, pink, so I think it's going to have to be changed out. Oh, my God, it looks like a normal house in here without the purple. Immediately to be met by the pink outside. Holy shit, it's just so bad. Uh, so the living room and all that, it gets... I mean, it's, it's not the greatest with the two-tone pinks going on in here. Uh, so I say we grab our paint bucket. We're going to need a shit ton of these. If we want to keep the same look on the bottom stairs or bottom portion of the home, I think we're going to need a... Probably a ton of these to get through. Uh, that should be plenty. Some solid progress has been made so far. We're not done yet, but uh, I'll pan around really quick and show you. Looks 20 million times better in here. Uh, the doors have got to go because those look shitty too. This house looked good, but it has some really like things that stand out. Like doors and certain floors are really shitty. Um, for some reason, they put the garage tile on the kitchen. I don't know. I think it was a bitch that smoked meth in here that enjoyed a whole bunch of pink and cracked tile. Oh, yeah. So much better. We just got to get rid of that nasty-ass pink fucking kitchen set bullshit, and we'll be good here. Okay, bathroom is painted. Outside, uh, out here is painted, and just where it meets the upstairs is not. So, honestly, it looks really good in here. I think I'm just going to get rid of everything, though, because it's just now in the way, and we don't need it. I do like the appliances that they used on certain things. I probably could have kept the stove. No place for books. I'm pretty sure I can bring it. Don't knock the points down. I'm getting it. Would you want me to just flip it as it was? I'm sure I could have flipped it for even more than what I bought it for without doing jack shit to it, but we might as well, right? Uh, we're up to $85,060, and uh, it's looking good. That really didn't take me that long to paint all that. It really wasn't that bad. Um, where's the five rooms? One, two, three, four. Well, where the fuck is it getting that other room from? Unless there's a bathroom up here. No, there's no bathroom. Well, what the shit? Okay, so this one before was like some laundry folding room, even though that's downstairs. I say we get intricate and we bust down a wall here, which turns it into a bathroom slash, you know, whatever the fuck else you want to use it for. Because I think that'll work perfect. And it would be like the last one that we just did too. So we're going to make ourselves a bathroom. Because before it was just being used for useless shit. There we go. Fantastic. Let's get rid of this too. Cool. And last but not least, I got a ton of paint left over. So let's grab this paint. I'm going to bring it upstairs. Put one in here. I think I only need one, honestly, for all this up here. Probably. I got a new perk point for faster painting. And goddamn, this is helping out tremendously. Um, it said something about paint multiple walls at once. For like my last remaining perk point for this. I just don't know what the fuck it's saying. So I'm not sure 
what exactly it how to like do multiple walls at once because i've tried to do that unless i can get some type of other tool here that i just don't see i'm not sure how that's possible well i haven't done one of these window cleaning things in so fucking long also i cannot reach this little fucking bit left which is kind of toxic uh so the whole house on the interior has been painted so we're gonna do a quick glance of it uh once i kind of get these clean let's just get these three windows clean that's weird the house was rather clean in general i don't know why those windows would be so dirty uh wants me to get scaffolding which i don't know <laughs> i don't know where that's at in the first place uh let's see structures you would think that it would be somewhere around here interesting i can't put this inside the house what am i supposed to do here how do they expect this to fucking work look at this shit okay so ladder but that's not even gonna work too watch this shit it's not gonna work it's hilarious what the fuck oh that's so toxic am i really not gonna be able to paint that little fucking bit oh i got up this ha, son of a bitch who needs that when you have a jank ass fucking house that literally you can use okay i think i got it all yeah we're good over there fuck that window i should just delete it all right everything's looking solid we're just we have a few god damn it what did i do yeah it's very clean it was very pink you guys are lucky i got rid of that shit uh let's get rid of some of this shit okay we're gonna go ahead and take a look around the house now which once was all pink and now is not all pink and uh still get rid of some of the stuff so we have like no pink left over I got that. The only uh, the only area where we do have pink is on the whole outside of the house. Uh, but that's going to be a fun little project in and of itself where I will need scaffolding uh, to get everything going. But it's almost nighttime out. So we've worked on the first house. We sold the first house, made a great amount of money. Uh, we got another house, which came completely stocked and furnished, which we're able to sell and make like a good, I don't know, 27,000 or 17,000 or something like that. I'm not sure which one. It was one of the two. Um... But yeah, no, I said that was very fucking solid. And we could probably flip this son of a bitch after getting some furniture in and make very, very good money. Um, and again, I want a sauna, so I don't know where I would do that, actually, now that I think about it. Actually, well, you know, who needs a bathroom downstairs? Wait a second. I think I just figured it out. This There's, there's like a lot of dead space over here, I feel like. Okay, so this is what I decided to do. Uh, we have two rooms here pretty much with what we have going on. So I'm going to turn some lights on so I can see. I don't have many lights. But uh, basically, this will be the living room. We can turn this into kitchen over there like it was before. Living room over here. You walk through here. This could be a sauna or we could do this as a bathroom. And then this is a sauna. Uh, leaving us just, you know, we could get rid of these windows. And then bada bing, bada boom. So I think that would be a really good thing. That way we can kind of have that extra stuff inside this house. We've already made it. Uh, one more available room and if we wanted to again we could kind of get rid of the you know garage that seems to be pointless honestly uh no real use of cars in this game so we might as well put it towards other stuff as of right now it looks good though i'm gonna probably fill out this wall here that way we can just make sure everything looks uh even and it kind of doesn't yeah that looks fucking flawless you have like a small lip there but honestly you can't even tell we'll put a door i think we're gonna have to kind of bust it down one more time yeah that's three so we're gonna get rid of i don't think i can move this once it's there it's there i don't want the sauna to kind of be opened towards the backyard that would not be fun for anyone involved so well let's get rid of some of the windows here i'm gonna clean this one really quick I think for pretty much all the windows I wanted to get rid of, that's it, though. We can keep the rest of them. We'll work around with artwork and all that stuff. Nice. Must look so much better in here. I want to do new doors as well, because those brown doors are just not it at all. Anywhere. Oh, yeah. We're making some good-ass progress, dude. We're making money instead of losing money, even though we've... How's that even possible? What the fuck, dude? All right, we ate the window in there, so we're gonna have to remember to get a window back. But uh, I'd say I'm pretty satisfied with this so far. Besides the shitty ass outside pink, uh, this is not bad. We have made money instead of spending it. Account balance is at 87,178. It was just at 86. So 
What the fuck, dude? Literally as simple as that. Okay, the rest of this paint buckets, I'm gonna move out onto the porch since we really don't have any more painting in here. The doors should cover up most of the uh, stuff that we do have and anything else that's left over. Well, we'll have plenty of plain, plain buckets. What? Paint buckets outside. We definitely are going to need a light out here. It is so dark. I say we fill this wall. We'll just have the bedroom here, which is just... Uh, why have two doors that... Well, honestly, I think it would look a little better instead of just having one room upstairs. You would have kind of two rooms. So we'll keep both those doors for now. But if it ends up looking too bad, we'll get rid of them. Uh, but that's going to be perfect. We had a ton of things go on today uh, here at the new house of ours. Could be the pink fucking... I don't even know what I would call this. A pink fucking crackhead. That's what we're calling it. Because this bitch was crazy in here with as much as she shoved inside of this house. Absolutely insane. Uh, that is going to be where we wrap it up, though, ladies and gentlemen. Leaving us for a brand new day on uh, our next episode where we can kind of really tackle this beyond belief. Uh, nonetheless, thank you so much for coming out of watching this episode of House Flipper. And we will see you next video.